And welcome back, everyone, to our special coverage here of Alex's Lemonade Stand Foundation. I hear the phones ringing. We are so happy to hear that. We want to continue right now by introducing you to another little girl. As the saying goes, when life gives you lemons, you make lemonade, right? This little girl had a pretty big obstacle thrown her way before she was even one year old. But as you're going to see, she has been jumping over obstacle after obstacle, both literally and figuratively. Take a look. Back, back. Who's there? It's up to cow. Interrupted count. No! Isabel Izzy Rita is quite a firecracker. Her mom, Sonia, says she was born that way. She just looked right up at me with those big eyes. And in that moment, it's almost like she showed who she is. Fast forward a year when Sonia noticed something just wasn't quite right. Izzy was having trouble turning her neck. After a trip to the emergency room, Izzy had an MRI. That revealed a tumor in her spinal cord and from there it was kind of a whirlwind. 14 months of chemotherapy, 42 chemo infusions, all to stabilize an inoperable tumor that Izzy might live with forever. Through it all, Izzy was happy, taking it all with a smile and a laugh. Sonia knows there's hope. Scientists are experimenting with a treatment that has worked on brain tumors in mice. Some of this research is funded through Alex's Lemonade Stand Foundation. We wonder if ever she needs more treatment, if this breakthrough could be it for her and that someday she won't have to live with the tumor anymore. The idea of that is mind blowing. We found Alex's Lemonade Stand Foundation and one of the things that we fell in love with was how they empower the children. Regardless of whether they've been in treatment, they've known someone in treatment or you know, they just want to help other kids. They really do empower kids to make a difference. And that's what Sonia and her husband wanted for Izzy. That empowerment has been evident in Izzy's participation in the foundation's lemon run. She was just starting to learn how to use her walker and she crossed the finish line with my husband holding her hands. The next lemon run in 2016, she was going to cross with her walker, but she wanted nothing to do with it. And so she actually crossed on her own. Then this past year in 2017, she crossed the finish line of the actual lemon run by herself, but she also participated in the kids' dash. No walker, she just ran across the field and she had a blast. Nothing is going to stop this little girl from crossing every finish line thrown her way. Sonia says Izzy is wise beyond her years. On a recent daddy-daughter date night, Izzy told her dad. You know what, daddy? Daddy-daughter date night, I think has been a success so far. Oh my goodness, those little pigtails. What a sweet girl and what an inspiration. It just brings a smile to her face to see her crossing that finish line year after year. So amazing. And you can help little girls and boys just like Izzy. Give us a call. I hear the phones ringing. We want to keep them going all day long. Again, the number to reach is 844-977-CBS3. That's 844-977-2273.